Hey everyone, welcome to Sims World. Everybody here is sleeping, but um, I wanted to take this time real quick to explain what I'm happening in this episode. Is something very, very special, um, and that is something that I added to the game that I think would be like realistic around this time, due to the fact that June being LGBTQ uh, Pride Month, um. I added to where that there is a festival day here in The Sims, and I think that we're going to spend the day mostly with Noah and Ace. Um, they've already talked to Vincent about it, and he's going to watch over Ambrose and keep a close eye on uh, Sabrina as well, since Michael's whole kind of going down the whole thing with him. But if you guys haven't noticed here, um, in the back there, we did... Um, bury Milo in the back, which you actually kind of see Milo's ghost, which is kind of sad, um, right now, out there, somewhere, I don't know where he is, not, there he is, it's Milo's ghost, guys, it's really, really sad to see, but we did, um, bury him, and then put a little flower out there, well, I should say that Noah did, um, And so it's really early in the morning, but very soon it's going to start the pride thing. And the actual thing is, is the reason why I'm saying that the kids are going to be watched by Vincent and that is because that um, Noah and them are planning on staying overnight at the festival because there are spots where they can do that. Um... So, I am going to just pretty much get this house ready to go for the festival, and I'll be back once we're there. Okay, guys, so we're here at the LGBTQ festival. Oh, and Ace just got shocked by lightning. So, yeah, I think that our best bet is to immediately get into our tents um, together. So... Why don't you guys go ahead and do that and just kind of wait and see if the rain holds or goes away. Um, and we will continue from there. So I'll be back in a little bit and we'll see if the rain went away or not. Okay, so it doesn't look like the rain's going to uh, go anywhere soon. So I'm hoping that nothing scary happens like it did with Ace. Ace, oh, okay, now it's snowing. So I would rather have it snowing, though, than it being electrocuted. So, um, and I think it's kind of beautiful now that I think about it, that the rain, or now that the uh, snow is gone. But Ace is still pretty dazed and all that a little bit self-explanatory but uh he these guys had to do a couple more things for their festival day um but they are going to be staying around here for the event we actually have a um stage here which i don't know if you can actually hire someone yes you can actually you can hire a professional DJ and all that hire you can't hire anybody yeah like a musician but that's so that sucks but you can hire a pianist and all that so that's really neat but ace I think is going to try to go ahead and give it a try to play the piano I mean if that's what floats his boat, these guys are just going to hang out around here at the festival here to uh, spend some time together and kind of like show support for others. I wish that like, 
I wish other Sims would kind of like show up here. It would be nice to kind of make it more realistic. I mean, we have our um, mixologist and stuff like that here, but... Oh, there is another Sim here. His name is Quentin Do Dozier. I think I might have made him. But anyways, we have a couple Sims here. Maybe, maybe these guys are, uh, Roxy. is this person famous or something? I don't know. But anyways, let's get back to our Sims. So he's here, checking it out. We have our actual professional pianist here now. The only thing that Ace has left to do is to get a drink, which, so why don't, Noah, why don't you try and do some music as well then? How about since you like, maybe, maybe my brother's into music, so maybe I could try the music? And then maybe we could go ahead and, did our, no, none of our, I hired people to come here. And not one of them came. So let's go ahead and hire a cupcake person to come and least so we have something to eat. Oh, that's, um... Zachariah's, uh, mom. She just gave us two cent, uh, two dollars for singing, so. Even though we weren't really trying, so. To get money. But thank you. I don't know if Noah would actually recognize who that is, because I don't think Noah's ever seen Zachariah. Okay, um... Ace is in the bathroom. Okay, and then we had to order some actual food then, too, so why don't you do that one as well? And then we can just get a drink from the bar. So why don't both of you guys head over here now? Oh, no, we don't want one of you face the thing. Okay, go here together. Ace, I know you're hungry, friendo, but we got to wait for our person to get here, so. Oh, and we have some kids here as well, so that's good. Oh, we might recognize some of these kids here. We've got Kiana. Maria and Riker here, which makes you think that maybe Cameron's here somewhere. Um, if we run into him, maybe we can say hello. But I think that, um, or maybe they're here with the nanny. Maybe, maybe. No, that's not our nanny, so. So, order food. Um... How about you order a fruit and yogurt parfait, and you, where are you going? No, don't do that. We, okay, you need to go to the bathroom, Ace. So why, I don't know why you didn't go when you were over there. So go ahead and do that. Use the bathroom. And then come back and order some food. But anyways, 
for now, Noah is eating his parfait. But Noah definitely knows the girl, the kids, so he's going to go ahead and say hello. I think he should know the kids, because, I mean, they are legally his, uh... Oh, Jessica's here as well, so I know he knows Jessica. He's a, well, he should, anyways. But um, there's a good, there's a bunch of little ones here, so that's good. That uh, the little ones are being um around this and getting to know these kind of couples and all that, and what this uh festival is all about. Ace, are you done in the bathroom? Oh, okay, so he's having an attitude because of, uh, being in a, uh, public bathroom. That was his problem. So why don't you go ahead and order some food, Ace, and then I'll let you head to bed for a little bit because you're tired. Um, and so are you, so you guys can go ahead over to the, um, tents then and take a little bit of a nap. Oh, but you have to use the bathroom first, so. Before you take a nap. You can use the bathroom first. Walking on sunshine's on here at The Sims. If you heard that music in the background. We have a couple other guys around here and all that, so maybe these guys could be potential um, friends that are in a same-sex relationship. Hear it? Obviously, it's in Simlish, but it's walking on sunshine. Okay. For now, he's just chit chatting with Kango, which is fine. Um, Ace, friendo, you are obviously done in the bathroom now. So you can go ahead and um, take a little bit of a nap. And then, once you're done eating, you can take a little bit of a nap. So, I'll be back once they get up from their naps. Okay, so they're back up, and it's going on like 10 p.m. Um, here. Um, I don't know if the, there is a roof on this. There is, but it's not going to be much help. But, they're watching... Some TV on the big screen, which is pretty much outside. So, why don't they go ahead and do that together so that they can, um, watch the this movie here. Um, a, we're just going to say it's called A Dog's Purpose, even though you can't really see it. Let's see if I can zoom it out, maybe. Bring it down, okay. We're just going to say it's a dog's purpose. Uh, they're going to watch it together. Even though it's in the rain. Um, and let's hope that nothing scary happened like it did before. With Ace. But, uh.
And it's kind of think making them think like they miss Milo, which was Noah's dog. Um, and it's kind of making Ace think like maybe we should get another animal. Maybe it should be another dog. Maybe. Um. But I think it's definitely super late here, and um, it's really bad weather for the event. So they were planning on staying here the whole day, or for the whole time of the event. But I think that they're going to head home now because of how bad it's raining and all that. So I'll be back once they get back home. And then once they get back home, Ace has a little bit of a plan set as a little bit of a, um, like a gift for Noah. So I'll be back once we get home. Okay, so we are back here at the house. And there's something that Ace had up his sleeve for this day in particular. Because he knows how much, um... A dog lover that Noah is. And not that Noah doesn't miss Milo. And Milo will always be in Noah's heart. But he wanted to give him another gift. And that gift is right here. Noah has yet to see him. His name is Jace. And he is a Jack Russell Terrier dog. And... He was delivered while they were at the festival. It was supposed to be happening later. But uh, he was delivered while they were at the festival as a, like, love day type of thing for them. Even though it really wasn't love day, it was kind of like a pride thing. And he kind of gave it the name of Jace because Ace, obviously. And then I, I tried to make it, like, a mixture between Noah and Ace, but I couldn't really figure it out. So I just gave it the name Jace um, because we're going to say that um, besides the name because besides the name Ambrose, Ace chose the name Ambrose and Noah always wanted the name their child Jace and so he got him a dog and named it Jace. So... Noah's going to now come on in here and uh, officially meet Jace. So, he's going to go ahead and calm him down a little bit. Because he's not really happy right now. Because he just pretty much... Uh, he doesn't know where he is kind of thing. And Noah is meeting Jace for the first time now. And I think that this is safe to say that... Um, Noah really does like his gift. Um, I'm trying to find the option. There it is. So he's going to go ahead and, um, just kind of like say thank you to Ace for the gift. So, with this said, guys, we had our um, Pride Festival, and Ace and M1, even though it probably wasn't the best experience um, at certain times for Ace because of, obviously, the lightning striking him. But anyways, it was a good experience to spend together with 
their loved ones. So these two really had a beautiful time there. Um, and when they came home, Ace had a little bundle of uh, happiness for Noah. And that is in the form of Ace. Or Jace, I'm sorry. So thank you guys for watching. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys all next week for another Sims World, but I'll see you guys all tomorrow for Sims Paradise. Peace!